Gold Coast. So I'm here with Hayes Epius. Nice, beautiful, sunny day on the Gold Coast. How are you feeling ahead of your fight? Yeah, good, bro. Really good. Really good. Um, so it's sort of a new experience uh, with all the in media and whatnot, but um, you know, feeling good. Feeling good. What does this fight mean to you having your fight shown to an international audience? Um, it means a lot. It means a lot. Um, not, not just fighting on such a big show, but sort of uh, showing the boys at my gym that sort of if, if you if you put in the work, you can you can get to the stage, and you guys can do it for yourself. You know, so it's more, it's more. Yeah, that, that means more to me than, than actually fighting on the show. And now we know you guys have shared the ring before. How have you prepared yourself mentally and physically different from last time around this sport? Oh yeah, no, it's, it's it's been massive. I think uh, my key focus on on the last fight, having come just from a, a six year layoff and then having less than a minute in the ring, um, my sole focus was just getting my fitness in check. So now I've been drilling a lot more sort of uh, IQ, as well as the fitness, but a lot more IQ tactics and, and sort of um, working on things we believe are holes and flaws in his, in his uh, game. So. Now, assuming you win this fight, what does victory mean to you and what pathways will this open up for the future? Man, who knows? Who knows? Um, after coming back uh, from a, from a big layoff, uh, I didn't expect to get here. To be honest, um, I was just sort of having a crack, and uh, so fuck, who knows? But um, I'm ready to take whatever whatever life throws at me. Man, um, I've had a couple of people from BKFC reach out, um, which is something I'm interested in, something that I may, I may do. Yep. Um, but yeah, who knows, man? Who knows? Last rule. Got any final words for Troy Pilcher? Nah, just, just be safe, brother. Look after yourself and um, let's put on a good show for, for our hometown.